Assalamu alaikum. Hello everyone. I am Musa Jolai and thank you so much for clicking to this video. Today's video will be a little bit different from my usual videos. I mostly don't prefer to talk in my videos, but in today's video I'll be talking throughout it. And to be honest, I'm a bit nervous because I am totally not used to it. But I hope that it will be a helpful video to whoever watching and trying to figure out YouTube and its system. I know that many of you watching this video are small YouTubers and probably you are trying to figure out uh, YouTube and its somewhat complicated system just like I was a while ago trying to pass the monetization requirements, becoming a part of YouTube Partners Program, and most important part, figuring out Google AdSense and its system. I've been dealing with YouTube for two years now. Two years before my current YouTube channel, I had another YouTube channel where I was creating content as well. But unfortunately, it couldn't last long and YouTube disabled my channel. I did everything according to the rules, but unfortunately, I couldn't pass the most important part, which was the AdSense paycheck for address verification. It was the pandemic time as well, so I suppose that was the main reason why my paycheck never arrived to me back then. Now coming to my current YouTube channel, after one and a half to two years of break from YouTube, I got motivated to open a new channel. I was very hopeful and faithful that uh, the paycheck will arrive to me or if it doesn't, then YouTube will help me somehow. And it literally happened that way, alhamdulillah. Now I will explain the whole process step by step so it can be heard and understood well by you. Let's get on to it. Number one, passing the monetization requirements. Unfortunately, it is one of the most hardest part, especially if you are a new content creator on YouTube. But don't let your mood go down because once you find the way to balance YouTube with your life, it will be easy for you, inshallah. I passed the monetization requirements six months after I opened my YouTube channel, but it was because I already had my little supportive community on Instagram who also supported me here on my YouTube channel, which I am very thankful for. My advice for new and small creators on YouTube is to hold a separate planner for your content ideas or just generally for your YouTube works. It will help you manage all the work neat and tidy. Don't worry, I will not advise you to post a new video every week because I know it's hard, but I'll tell you, posting a new video shortly after another will help you gain 4,000 watch hours quickly. The more videos you post, the more they will start popping up on other people's YouTube homepage. But a video itself is not enough obviously. The editing style, the music decisions, the thumbnail, and even the description is important to catch attention, especially these days. I am planning to film another video on how I edit my YouTube videos and thumbnails, so make sure to subscribe and stay tuned for that. 2. Joining the YouTube Partners Program. After passing the monetization requirements, YouTube will want you to open a Google AdSense account. Google AdSense is where you will get paid from and you will have more details about all the payment works, etc. After that, your account will get reviewed by YouTube. As long as you don't have any bad or just inappropriate videos, your channel will get approved by YouTube. Ads will start appearing into your videos, which means you'll get paid from YouTube. But that's not it, y'all. There's more, and in fact, there is a very big part coming up. Now let's move on to our third step, which is the Google AdSense. To officially start getting paid from your YouTube videos, you must also pass some of the requirements on Google AdSense. First of all, you must have a Google AdSense account. You can make one easily, but here's a very important note that I needed to know two years ago. If you are under 18, please use your parents' information with their permission or it can be someone older than 18 and close to you. But don't forget, you must have their approval and permission. I am under 18, I am 17 years old, so I am using my mom's information uh, on Google AdSense with her permission. Once you've opened a Google AdSense account, there are a couple requirements to officially start getting paid from your YouTube videos. A. Provide tax information. B. Confirming personal information, which also includes the AdSense address verification PIN, that little paycheck thingy. C. Selecting payment method. D. Payment threshold. Most of these are quite easy, but they do need time since Google AdSense needs to review and approve all of the informations. Please make sure that your personal informations are fully same with the documents 
you will be sharing with the Google Adsense. Now coming to step B. For me, personally, it was the most hardest part to deal with. You need to have lots of time and plenty of patience for this part. There are two little conditions when it comes to step B. First, confirming personal information, where Adsense will ask you to share some type of government document of you. And second, the address verification, where Adsense will ask your full address from you so that they can send a paycheck with a personal identification number in it, which we shortly call as PIN. For some, AdSense may not require to confirm personal information, but for all, they do require to confirm the address verification PIN. While entering your address, please make sure that it is in your own language. For example, even though I create English content, my AdSense address information is written in Turkish since I live in Turkey. Well, actually, that's how I did this time and alhamdulillah it arrived, so yeah. It will be good if you do that as well. After adding all the address informations, you have to wait from two to three weeks until the paycheck with the PIN will arrive. If it doesn't arrive, then you can request them to reset the PIN. You have four months of time until the PIN arrives to you. If it doesn't arrive until four months, ads will stop appearing into your videos, which means you will also stop getting paid from YouTube. Just like I said, this time I did everything, you know, added all my informations in Turkish. Uh, since I live in Turkey, I requested the PIN and start waiting for it. But this time, alhamdulillah, I was much calmer and chill and I had more faith in it. It didn't arrive at my first request, so I requested the second time and the same happened. I requested the third time, the same happened and also with the fourth one as well. I requested the first pin uh, during mid-July 2022 um, and I waited until uh, the end of October 2022. So then I received this mail from YouTube and basically it was saying that if I don't enter the address verification pin, my uh, videos will get disabled from ads, which means that ads will stop appearing into my videos. That's when I started to get stressed and my motivation started to go down and I was like, oh boy, here we go again. So I started searching and watched several videos on YouTube about this whole AdSense address verification pin. But to be honest, it didn't help too much except for this one video um, and it was saying that there is this online system where if you communicate with the Google uh, community help, they will somehow, you know, approve your address online like without the paycheck without this one so i wrote to the google adsense community help and thankfully they responded in a very short time and according to their respond if i have requested the pin more than four times google adsense and youtube will approve my address online and you have no idea how happy i was or how happy i got after reading that mail that uh, i received from the google community help i was like Finally, it actually works like and there was also a link that they sent to me I clicked the link and communicated with AdSense and you guys will not believe this within less than 10 minutes My address got approved. I mean if it is that easy Then why do they make us wait for four freaking months just for this little piece of paper? Anyways, um, this all was supposed to happen. That's how I react to certain situations in my life it was supposed to happen and it happened, you know, and it really taught me some good lessons. <laughs> I will definitely leave the link uh, in the description below for you if you are also struggling with this pin situation and you've already, you know, requested the pin for more than four times. But the funny part is, a week after my address got approved on my AdSense account, my paycheck came and I was completely shocked. And something even more funny is that there were only a couple days left for my YouTube videos to get disabled. I mean, obviously, if my address wasn't approved online, I still could have managed to get my address approved by waiting a little bit more <laughs> with the paycheck arriving. But yeah, just like I said, it was meant to happen and it happened. This is just me, YouTube and AdSense, very toxic, complicated relationship. And I'm actually happy with it, you know? Still looking at this little piece of paper makes me very happy and proud. Uh, it's, it's, it's really good. It's a very nice feeling. I also want to chit chat about, uh, you know, how to be successful on YouTube, especially at the current age, um, because I feel like it is way, way, way more harder than before. 
uh, I mean back then around like 2016 or 2015 and stuff like editing was much easier thumbnail was much easier um, but now everything just must be like aesthetically pleasing your editing style, the thumbnails, even like the descriptions, just like I said before. Back then, when you split it a couple of videos and bring them together, it would be like a big success. People would be like, wow, your editing is amazing. I can't believe how you just, you know, brought together all those clips and made like a beautiful video. But now they look at the uh, texts and the fonts and I don't know, like the filter, everything. So like people, like the viewers, uh, and even the youtubers as well like they look at the details more and more like day by day which i think is like it's okay but it's definitely getting harder and i do understand all the small youtubers out there since i am also a small youtuber as well um but all i have to say is just be you and uh just you know make your own authentic videos because the more you just focus on to your own style, the better uh, your videos will get and you will also like, you know, build a little community who also shares the common vibes with you, the common aesthetic, the common style with you and I think that sounds very very peaceful and amazing and super supportive. Uh, so yeah, that's the little <laughs> talking I wanted to make about the you know, to be successful on YouTube at the current age, um, but yeah. I hope this video was helpful to you. Um, I really needed to watch this kind of video, especially two years ago, but unfortunately there were like so less that I had like no other chance but to just figure out the whole YouTube and AdSense system by myself. And uh, you know, I want to be that somebody to you who uh, just helps with all the complicated YouTube situations. Don't worry, never lose hope. Uh, everything is about being consistent. I mean, if you want to actually be successful, and achieve your goals and dreams you have to be consistent with it i know it's hard to do the same thing every day and every day and every day but i promise you hard work actually pays off thank you so much for watching this video and i hope it was helpful to you stay safe may allah bless you love you goodbye